All right, I thought we would just jump right in. Um, so today I need to figure out what I'm gonna wear with my sister little outing, um, which you will see tomorrow. Uh, but yeah, so we are going to get a massage. We're gonna get petties. Well, I'm getting petties. She's probably gonna get a mani. Um, and a little lunch. And then we're going to a beautiful restaurant. Um, we're gonna have dinner at a place that uh, that I've seen that looks really, really cute. It is, I'm very excited about it. But anyway, what we're doing today is we're trying to figure out what to wear uh, for our little sister adventure. So today I wanted to start, I feel like I definitely wanna wear these boots. I'm not sure, I, I really do wanna wear these. So this is kind of what I'm going off of, but I do have some other fits that don't go with these, we're gonna see. We're gonna see what we vibe with. Anyway, so this is a cute little crop top. It's burgundy, uh, which kind of goes with that burnt, it looks burgundy, but it's actually, I think, like a burnt orange and brown in there. Um, and I thought this is like super PSL outfit sort of thing, which we love. And I've been meaning to do sort of a pumpkin spice latte kind of girly fit look, lookbook fit thing, thing, you know what I'm saying. Anyway, so that's that's kind of the vibe here, the inspiration, um, but yeah, and I really love these over the knee boots. I love them so much that hopefully tomorrow the black version of these will be coming. I'm so excited. Anyway, um, but yeah, I figured what's more October, fall, PSL than plaid. Um, burgundy is fabulous with these colors too. I do feel like I'm missing leopard, but I wanna wear a bow. Let me see what it looks like. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I just feel like maybe plaid, <clears throat> plaid and leopard might be a little too much. I mean, it looks amazing with the burgundy, but the plaid is kind of, no, it's clashing, but I do, now it's got in my brain. Now it's in my brain. Okay, so we're definitely gonna think about this. But anyway, um, I love this look. Oh, by the way, I also got, these are little teddy bear hooks that make things fit better when they're too big or loose. I needed them. Can you hear me when I said that? Did that go against my, I'm so sorry. These are teddy bear hooks that go, uh, you know, they're like little pins and then they hook together. And so they make the waist of what you're wearing fit, which is exactly what I've been looking for. I've been using belts and <laughs> tying things with hair pins and stuff like that. So I found these and I, I mean, it looks a little weird in the back. I mean, the teddy bears are pretty cute, but you know, this whole thing. Anyway, I don't know. It's cute. I love it. Uh, but it, the skirt does not fit very well because it's too big now. But the teddy bears fix that, right? Also, they're super cute. Should they be like more in the front? Kind of like a detail so it looks more purposeful? Anyway, they had a few different ones. These were supposed to be gold. They're not very gold. They're more of like a brassy finish, which is kind of disappointing. Whatever. I'll see if I can find any more. See if I like any other designs. They had some bows that I thought were super cute and they had like celestial like stars. So I definitely feel like I need to pick up a few more anyway, but yeah. So this is the first look and uh, let's dive into the next one. All right, next. All right, so this is rubbing against my necklace, sorry. Hopefully it's not too bad. Anyway, maybe I'll just hold it. Um, so this is my next look. Actually, I'm kind of obsessed with this. Ooh. All right, so this is just your classic sweater dress. I cinched in the waist with a belt. It didn't really need cinching in, but I like to, you know, make it a little mm -mm extra. And of course, with this, because it's all neutrals, we can wear our neutral little leopard bow. Oh my God, oh my God. Do I do it? Mm -hmm. It looks amazing with the boots too. Oh, this is so good. Plus with all the touches of gold, it just feel, oh, this is so gorgeous. 
Oh man, it is a little short though. But I'm wear I I figured the this dress would be nice because it's supposed to go up to 74 today, which is very nice considering yesterday was like 60. So that's like 15 degrees colder. No thank you. Um but anyway, oh I love this. Oh my god. Maybe this is the look. I don't know. I have I have three more to go. But uh, let me know in the comments which is your favorite. I love this dress. I've worn this to the city. This whole actually like this fit minus like the belt. This is the first time I think I've paired the belt with it. And I'm obsessed with it. Oh my God. Why haven't I done this before? Anyway. Um, and the bow. Mm, there's always a new way to spice something simple up. You know what I mean? It's just, oh, so fun. Okay. But, oh, See, I had a vision in my head what I was going to go towards, and then I pulled this out, and I was like, yes, classic, simple, but now I'm kind of obsessed with it. Anyway, let me know in the comments which is your favorite, by the way, and um, and then you'll see tomorrow what I end up going with, but oh my god, I really did not expect this to hit so hard. Okay, all right, again, simple simple sweater dress. I like it because the sleeves are nice and puffy. You know how I feel about, you know, statement sleeves. Um, I love the, the mock turtleneck. I love that I can wear my leopard bow with it. I love that it's this short and it doesn't like clash with how high the boots are. It just like gives just enough skin to be like super sexy and yet still very demure. And, um, you know, like there's no bubbies. It's just leg. It's literally just leg. Oh my God. Sometimes the simplest things are the sexiest things. Anyway. All right. Let me show you the next look. You'll have to tell me. You see I'm stalling because I don't want to take it off because it's so cute, but we got to figure this out. We got to figure it out now. All right. Next. All right, this is me switching it up on you. No, I'm not wearing the boots at all. No leopard in sight. I know, I know. But I couldn't, I couldn't count out the spooky sweater but, and leather. Let's be honest. Leather is a must. It's a need. It's a, I love it. I also get a lot of ish if I don't wear these leather pants with like a belt because they don't have a button at the top. They're just a zipper. And so like people are like, it just looks unfinished. It doesn't look right. I'm like, but that's how they're made. <laughs> I just get so much ish about it. And I'm telling you, I'm not really like a belt kind of gal, but here we are. Also it's brown. I don't know if that really matters, but it's like a super dark brown. I think it's all right. I think it still looks good. It's got like this brassy detail that goes with the watch. And you know, I love to wear the gold anyway. So I think it works. Also, if you're wondering where I got this sweater, I got it at TJ Maxx. I saw it on the rack and I fell head over heels in love with it. It is so cozy and it's so cute and spooky with the skulls, but also like I just genuinely love this and I would wear this any time of the year for sweaters. Like I just think it's so cute. Also, I'm a little macabre, so that makes sense for me. <laughs> it's a little throw to the goth that I never got to be or ever you know, played into. But anyway, so that's this look. I love it. I also think that it's really nice with the V-neck. It, you can see my necklaces that I really like to wear. Um, a little skin where there isn't any anywhere else. So I think it's cute. All right. Like I said, let me know in the comments below, which is your favorite. You can't do fall without some leather in your look or a leather look. You have to have a little leather. You know what I'm saying? So... If you like leather and you like skirts, you're really gonna like this next one, so. Two more to go, all right, next. All right, second to last, yes, lots of bubbies, but we have to have our leopard. Um, again, this is too, sadly, this skirt is, it's express, it's a size four, but I needed it in a two. For some reason, express sizes are slightly too big for me, so, um, when I got this, it fit pretty good, but I lost more weight. So now I need it to be smaller, but I put in the belt so that it doesn't look as weird. 
and so that I can kind of like cinch it in a little bit more because I can't use the teddy bear pins because this is leather. Um, but you know, I feel like I kind of am obsessed with it. I love this look. It's very sexy. It's very fall. I do, I will need like, like a shawl or a little jacket or something, but I have my stockings to keep my legs. What I like about these, aside from what happened, they promised me that that wouldn't happen, but it keeps happening. Um, when I first got it, that's exactly what happened. But anyway, they're sparkly. I don't know if you can catch it on the screen there on the, on the camera, but they are sparkly, which I do love about them. Um, and they're very comfortable. I Like I said, it's just that, yeah, they promised me that wouldn't happen. And as soon as I put it on, that's exactly what happened. Runs in my tights, but whatever. Anyway, um, yeah, I love, this is just a bodysuit from Shein. <laughs> Cheap, comfortable, very sexy, very effective in what I wanted to do. Um, but yeah, simple, all black and boots. Keep my feet warm my feet aren't warm, I'm not happy. So yeah. All right. Let me show you the last look. All right. And I need you to let me know in the comments below, which one was your favorite and, uh, what would you wear for your little, your little adventure out? The problem with this is tights make it hard for like, um, when you're getting pedicures and stuff like that. So that might be an issue but I kind of feel like I also need them to keep my feet, my legs warm because it is gonna be chilly and then for the evening it's gonna be even chillier. But maybe I can just change? I don't know, we'll see. Anyway, let me show you the last look and uh, yeah, all right, next. All right, last but certainly not least. All right, I like this because it's simple but I still get to wear my favorite boots. And um, there's that belt again. I don't know, I think it's growing on me. I don't know, what do you guys think? I kind of am obsessed with this, honestly, actually. I really like this. Okay, maybe, but is it better than the sweater dress? I don't know, anyway. All right, so that's the last look. I hope you guys had fun with me. I am like freaking out. You see, I lost a nail. I was like trying to rush so much, um, but that's easy to fix. Anyway, I hope you guys had an amazing day. Let me know in the comments below which one was your favorite look um, and what you think I should wear. And I will, I will keep you posted and you'll see tomorrow. Anyway, I hope you had an amazing day. Thank you so much for spending time with me today. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. And as always, I will see you tomorrow. Until next time.